What's up internet this is Manish from the code makers and today in this Oracle database video I'm going to show you database connectivity using SQL developer and command prompt to your local host and to some other machine in your lenses database server I know I have already shown you a brief about this in my previous video, but today we will see more in depth Okay, let's start it open up your SQL developer and for creating new connection go to this green plus button here and uh, press it you'll get a new connection window and in this connection window first thing you need to fill is the connection name it can be anything you can give whatever name you want and I'll give HR at local and then username it must be a valid oracle user you can either create a new user or can use predefined user like hr or scott also you can use sys and system they are privileged user for your database yes i'll show you how to use this and system in our future video so i'll give i'll make a connection with hr user on my local host so i'll put hr here password it should be a valid password for your user my password for HR user is HR only so I'm gonna put HR like save password you can also choose a color for your connection click here and choose a color I'll choose blue okay now host name my database is installed on this machine only so my host name will be localhost so let's don't touch it 1521 is a default port number so let it be like it I haven't changed it so my database using 1521 only if you mess with this port number just make sure you'll put the appropriate port number here now comes SID which is a global database name and our SID is ORCL which we define at the time of installation you can check my previous video on Oracle installation and so I'm gonna put ORCL here that's it let's test a connection okay the status is success means everything is okay now press connect that's it we are connected to our local HR user okay guys let's try to do the same with a command prompt for creating a connection using command prompt just open up your command prompt in Windows system we need to set Oracle SID so write set Oracle SID equal to ORCL which is a global SID global database name we configured it during the installation you can check my previous video on uh, database installation now hit enter you can check it by writing eco percentile or recall SID sorry recall SID percentile as you can see it's ORCL now let's connect to our SQL for doing so just write SQL plus yeah and then followed by username which is hr forward slash password which is hr hit enter now we are connected to our sql plus and to user hr to check just write show user terminator hit enter as you can see we are connected to hr user another way <coughs> sorry another way for making this connection or creating this connection is just come out from this sql prompt for doing so just write quit hit enter now we are on our command prompt again now write sql plus forward slash no log hit enter we are connected to our sql plus but we are not connected to any user you can you can see this by writing show user terminator as you can see we are not connected to any user to make a connection with some user write co double and con username forward slash password hr we are connected to our HR user you can check it by using this query so as you can see we are connected to HR okay now let's see how to connect some other machine in your LAN which has a Oracle database installed it can be a database server in your office or a desktop in your home 
I will use my desktop for creating this connection and this time we will use sys as our connecting user as a connection user sorry okay then first we will make a connection to a server or a machine in your LAN using SQL developer so open up your SQL developer to create a new connection again come to this green plus button click it you will get this new connection window as I have told you in the connection name you can give whatever you want I'm going to give sys at LAN in the username this time I'm going to create a connection using my sys user so I'm going to put sys password for my sys user is oracle click save password choose a color this time I'm going to choose red as we are connecting to sys we need to give sys dba role to our sys it cannot get connected using default role or a normal as a normal user so come here in this role section click this list select sys dba we are dealing with the machine in a LAN so we need to give the IP address here as I am going to connect to my desktop so I have to give my desktop IP address here and the IP address for my desktop is 192.168.11.104 port 1521 is a default port number so it's good with me if you have changed it just put uh, appropriate port number here SID as I have told you this is an, a unique a global unique identifier and we are using ORCL okay I guess everything is fine here let's test our connection as you can see status is success it means everything is okay so click connect it's gonna take time okay this time it's very quick we are connected to sys user as you can see you can check using show user control enter as you can see we are connected to sys user okay guys let's now see how to do same thing using our command prompt so just open up your command prompt as i have told you in windows system we need to set the oracle sid first so write this oracle sid equal to orcl you can check it by eco percentile oracle sid percentile orcl now to make a connection to a machine in your land write sql plus username write sys forward slash password or recall which is the password for my sys user now we are dealing with sys user so we need to provide a sys dba role here so put as sys dba don't give a space right at the rate ip address of your machine to which you want to create a connection 192.168.11.104 this is an ip address for my desktop from which i am creating this connection colon now provide the port number as you remember 1521 is the default port number now forward slash here you need to give the database name or a uh, uh, global sid global identifier your database and as you remember orcl is the sid of our database now hit enter okay we are connected to our sys user at uh, our machine 192.168.11.104 you can check it by writing show user okay now you can see to which database we are connected right now for doing so just right select lct select name from v dollar database which is an view okay we are connected to orcl that's it for this video guys hope you like it and thanks for commenting sharing liking and watching more of our video your appreciations means a lot to me if you like please subscribe give a thumbs up thanks once again